hello guys so I have this website I'm working on and then uh, there's this particular product that um, requires a minimum uh, quantity and this is the product and as you can see it's just uh, 400 uh, Nigerian Naira which means uh, it's less than a dollar so the owner of this website has requested that um, the minimum quantity should be 50 so for you to make this purchase you're gonna have um, at least a minimum quantity of 50 but the problem now is um, uh, the, I've been trying to find a way to do that because WooCommerce ordinarily does not come with that option so if you check uh, in the product page so you can see the options that are available so inventory can only allow you to manage stock and then um, so you can set the stock quantity and then you can set the low uh, stock threshold okay so but that that is the that is the most you can do um, there is no option for you to set the required minimum quantity and then I've been searching online for a plugin but the one I've, I've seen so far is the WooCommerce uh, product minimum quantity so and then uh, if you check this I've checked this uh, product and it's about um, $29 but man I don't want to spend a dime on this um, I don't want to build this client again I, I needed to find a way so I kept searching until I come across these guys the code astrology.com so I found one of their plugin which is the WooCommerce the WooCommerce minimum maximum quantity and step for single product now this plugin did for me the magic now uh, you can download it I'm gonna leave the leave a link in the description of this video right yeah then you can download that um, this plugin from their website um, by clicking on this uh, button here so if you click here so it's gonna take you to the WordPress um, repository where you can download this um, plugin it's a very fantastic plugin like you can see has five star 28 reviews and just one uh three persons read them two and uh, and one stars so you can see that it's a very good plugin but i didn't download it from here too so i'm just gonna copy this name copy this name so i went back to uh my wordpress dashboard so under plugin so i'm gonna go uh, add me a new plugin so I click on add new and then I'm gonna paste what I just copied so you can see it right here you can see the logo um, if I scroll back up now you can see the logo right here so yeah that is the plugin so I'm gonna go to install and then I'm gonna go ahead and, and activate this uh, plugin so now this plugin has been activated uh, if I scroll you can see it uh, right here main mark quantity and step control for WooCommerce so I'll go back to my product page remember this uh, client has asked me to set the minimum quantity uh, to 50 pieces so for you to make an order it has to be 50 or the website is going to uh, throw an error so if I come over to the product page uh, to the product edit page and I refresh this place so I'm going to refresh the page so if I refresh this page and I scroll me back down you can see this fantastic uh, tab here with a new option for us now that is what that plugin 
does for us so if I click on it so I'm, uh, you see I can actually set the minimum and maximum quantity and the steps now the minimum quantity like the client has um, asked me to is uh, 50 so the default quantity I'll set that to 50 as well so that um, when you want to order the minimum the default quantity you will find is 50 so you can increase so I'm gonna I'm not gonna have a maximum quantity for this product but you can set it if that is the case for you now there is the quantity step I've set it to 5 what the quantity step does is uh, it, it's going to increment so if you click on the incre increment um, icon it's going to increment the quantity by 5 so if I do 10 that means it's going to increase increment this quantity by 10 which is to say um, when you have 50 and you in click on the increment icon it's going to have 60 another click we make it uh, 70 and in that order so but for now I'm gonna leave it for five and then I'm gonna go ahead and then um, update so the product have updated as you can see here so I just I'm just gonna go ahead and, and do preview for this product so you see that automatically 50 is being set for this product so if I go to increment it goes to 55 and so on so if I bring it down so when I do I, I, I try to bring it down below 50 it doesn't work so that is what this plugin has helped me to achieve so if I add to cut um, you're gonna see something you can see that 50 of this product has been added to my cart and if I view cart remember each of this product is 400 Nigerian Naira so if I click on the product on the uh, cart you can see that yeah the price is here and the quantity is set to 50 and the subtotal is 20,000 and then uh, you can see um, the the uh, shipping fee is also calculated because of my uh, IP is legal, so it's one thousand for shipping. So yeah, this product, this plugin um, helps you to solve that problem. And I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If it does, please leave a like of this video and leave a comment for me. Let me know what other plugin you use or how this has been helpful for you. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, for more videos like this one. So thank you for coming by.